What makes a Nazi? How does he get that way? Well, let's look into the process. To begin with, Nazi control over a German child starts as soon as it's born. A young German couple has come to register the birth of their son. Heil Hitler. Heil Hitler. Heil Hitler! Herr Standesbeamte, wir möchten unseren Jungen anmelden. Unseren Erstgeborenen. Gib alle Geburtsscheine. Ja, hier sind unsere Geburtsscheine. Die Geburtsscheine unserer Eltern. Those documents are birth certificates. All the way back to their great grandparents. Proving, of course, that they are pure Aryan. Wir möchten auch gern wissen, ob wir unseren... The mother wants to call her son Hans. Dieses Verzeichnis enthält alle männlichen Namen, die für Kinder arbeiten. Here's the verboten list. Mm -hmm. Hans seems to be okay for the time being. This is their hereditary passport with space for 12 future children. A subtle hint, Germany needs soldiers. As a reward, they get a copy of Germany's bestseller. Now let's see what happens to one of Hitler's children. Kindergarten. And little Hans learns the fairy tales of the new order. Remember the story of the Sleeping Beauty? Hans was taught that the Wicked Witch was democracy. And Sleeping Beauty? Who can she be? Aha! Here comes the prince. The prince is victorious. Democracy has fled. The prince breaks the magic spell with a kiss. The beautiful princess is Germany. Oh. And the brave, handsome knight, you know who he is. Heil Hitler! Heil Hitler! Heil! This Nazi fairy tale seems to be that Hitler got Germany on her feet, climbed into the saddle, and took her for a ride. The distortion of this tale has its purpose in molding the young Nazi mind. Hitler becomes Hans's idol. But one day, Hans became sick. His mother is praying that her son get well. She knows that the unfit are taken away by the state and are never heard of again. Er muss kräftig sein. Sie holen die Schwachen fort und niemand weiß, was es ist. Heil Hitler! Heil Hitler! Was ist denn schon wieder los mit Hans? Ist er denn schon wieder krank? Was hat er denn? Hütte! Ja! Sie verwöhnen den Jungen! Aus dem wird nie ein guter Soldat! Sollte aus Hans ein untauglicher Schwächling werden? Dass Sie wissen ja wohl, was ich meine. Nächstes Mal erwarte ich einen besseren Bericht. Dieser sentimentale Quatsch muss aufhören. Das bitte ich mir aus. Heil Hitler! This Superman has just reminded Hans's mother that unless this mollycoddling stops, the state will have to step in and take over. Ich schwöre, bedingungslosen Gehorsam für den Führer des Deutschen Hans recovered. Back in school, he's giving his daily pledge to fight, obey, and die for his Führer. 
which pleases the Fuhrer very much. And Herr Goering. And Herr Goebbels, too. Sehr gut. Sehr gut. Und nun, Kinder, werden wir unsere Naturkundestunde halten. Hans' school teacher is about to give the class a little lesson in natural history. Jetzt einen Hase. Und nun zeichne ich einen Fuchs. Nun passt gut auf, was jetzt hier passiert. Now let's see what they learn from this little lesson. Wer kann mir sagen, was wir daraus lernen können? Hans? Das arme Häschen. He said the poor rabbit. Is he out of his mind? Donnerwetter doch mal! Dummkopf! Was für eine blöde Antwort ist denn das? Geh in die Ecke! Was? Eins, zwei, drei! Eins, zwei, drei! Rauf auf den Stuhl! What would the Führer think of such a stupid answer? What would Herr Gering say? And Herr Goebbels? Don't come! Wer kann mir nur die richtige Antwort geben? Now then, who can give the correct answer? Ich weiß! Es zeigt uns, dass die Welt dem Starken gehört! The world belongs to the strong! Und dem Brutalen! And to the brutal! Der Hase ist schwach und feige und verdient... The rabbit is a coward and deserves to die! They spit on the rabbit! Nice kids. Good. Good. Ausgezeichnet. Und nun, Hans, was denkst du jetzt von dem armen Häschen? Ich hasse es. es He hates the rabbit. There's no room for weaklings. Hans is learning fast. My, how he hates that rabbit. Ich hasse ihn. So, das ist besser. Hans has come around to the correct Nazi way of thinking. Nice going, eh, Adolf? Ja, unsere Naturkunde lehrt uns, dass Deutschland... Yes, this lesson is the basis for the Nazi creed. For Germany will likewise destroy all weak and cowardly nations. Wir sind die nordische Rasse. Alle anderen Völker werden unsere Sklaven sein. Germans are a super race. All of us will be slaves. Wir sind unübertrefflich. Wir fürchten niemand. Germans are unconquerable. They fear no one. Listen to the fanatic cry. Heute gehört uns Deutschland. Morgen die ganze Welt. Today we own Germany. Tomorrow the whole world. Hans is now ready for the higher education as decreed by the Führer. Marching and hiling, hiling and marching, Hans grows up. In him is planted no seed of laughter, hope, tolerance, or mercy. For him only hiling and marching, marching and hiling, as the years grind on. Manhood finds him still hiling and marching. But the grim years of regimentation have done their work. Now he is a good Nazi. He sees no more than the party wants him to. He says nothing but what the party wants him to say. And he does nothing but what the party wants him to do. And so he marches on with his millions of comrades, trampling on the rights of others. For now his education is complete. His education for death.